had a few people ask me to um, give them more information on the parts that I was using to build the uh, laser harp. Uh, I am currently working on some plans, by the way, and I'm going to package them up and have them ready, uh, schematics, diagrams, and all the source code available, hopefully by the end of the week. Uh, my laptop is hosed at the moment. This is a new one. It came with Vista. Couldn't get anything to run on it. None of the drivers work, so I'm trying to get XP back on there at the moment, which is taking a little bit of time. <laughs> uh, someone asked me if I um, could make one with a laser pointer. Um, the answer is not really, um, simply because the laser pointer doesn't have... Uh, proper driver uh, and I don't know how long a laser pointer can be kept on for and also it doesn't have any kind of control of the beam. This is the kind of laser that you need. This is made by Lazeva in China. Um, this is an 80 milliwatt laser which I've tested the harp with and it works really really well. Um, and it has variable power if we open that and I think you'll, you can see it's considerably brighter than the laser pointer. It makes for a better show. Um, it's got variable power so I can adjust the output level but more importantly, it's got this, which is blanking control. That is a socket to uh, allow you to control uh, the laser output level and switch it on and off very, very quickly, which is kind of important. Okay. Um, and then here we've got the scanner. Um, this is the amplifier board, which you can get on eBay. Um, you can get a set of two of these uh, for about $300. Uh, we only want one for the laser harp. And that drives this, which is kind of delicate. Let me bring this in so you can see. This is the galvanometer mirror. This is the mirror that moves really, really fast. Um, I think you can see that mirror now. Uh, and this connects to this and is driven by, let me just put that down over there, this, which is the Arduino, which is an Atmel uh, Mega 16.8, I think that's the uh, microprocessor. Um, you can get these online from a variety of sources. Spark Fun sell them, Lady Ada, uh, sorry, adafruit.com, um, and one of the places that escapes me. Uh, Trossen, Trossen Robotics sells them too. Um, so that is what you need to get there. That plugs into this, which drives the mirror which bounces the laser around. And that's pretty much it uh, for now. LCD panel that I got, make sure you get one um, that supports the correct protocol. I forget the protocol, but it will be in the plans. Uh, it's SED1397, I think is the chip. I might be might be wrong there. Uh, yeah. Oh, someone made a comment uh, about the sound uh, that the harp opens is actually the sound of the TARDIS. It is, and that's the TARDIS there. So that's where the sound of the laser harp came from. It's actually from a BBC science fiction show. 